Turning Point is a project based able to learn more than your average grade level. Think of more creative and innovative solutions to problems. Have different things instead of F, A plus, you know. So that's school that's like out of the ordinary. It's different. Turning Point is a school where you can learn at your own pace and where you can be yourself and basically it's really nice that we can talk to like everyone in the school we know everyone in the school uh even if they're not our friends we're not like all mean to each other you can learn at your own pace you can be yourself and like you can be the shyest person in the world and then like you can just make friends it's a school that let me do more things. Here I'm always doing something. We have unique personalities over here and it's kind of easy to make friends. As it, it's not just sticking your head in a book all day and being bored in a chair. You get to do stuff. You get to interact with others. You get to, it's a home. Um, it's a really different environment and mo that's the biggest thing is that we can learn different and we can communicate differently and everything based on like our family environment. And we aren't so restricted and we are trusted to work like on our own. We don't always have to be studied by the teachers and then it just lets you be yourself and no if something if you did something weird no one will say anything. Um, to me, Turning Point is a place where students get the opportunity to um, learn at their own pace, but they also get the opportunity to know that it's okay to make mistakes and use it as a learning experience to help them reflect on decisions so that they can make some better choices. Uh, even though they taught us that the classroom was owned by the students, uh, Turning Point really uh, put you in a position as a teacher to practice that. Turning Point represents a new approach to education. It's not necessarily better, it isn't worse. It's an alternative. It provides more of a community atmosphere where the success of the whole depends much more on its individual parts, more so than your traditional schools. Uh, Project-based learning allows students to take more of an ownership uh, in their own learning and really allows students to greater opportunities to tap into their individual creativity uh, rather than the rote memorizations that's so often attributed to your traditional school. Uh, the technology-based learning of Turning Point also allows for greater mobility, uh, interactions among peers and staff, uh, whether it's found on the floor working on projects, you know, down in the foyers making a video documentary, um, or whether we're online on a document or in a, uh, discussing current events. I mean, it, it allows more and more opportunities to learn rather than sitting at a desk and the presentation screens up every single day of the week. When I was at uh, my other school, I would normally just sit and read a book. I could read two to three books in a day because I was, I could get my stuff done in five minutes. Here I'm always doing something. I had a lot of issues with um, being too shy and not like being out there enough and participating in things and Turning Point really changed me with being more outgoing and being able to challenge myself. Um, it has changed me because like when I was in uh, other schools I was like way too shy to actually ask for help and learn and now here I'm actually learning than just sitting at the back of the class. Um, Turning Point has changed me to where I'm more responsible with my work and to take things more seriously. Uh, Turning Point has forced me to give up the day-to-day -day control that I was used to in the traditional environment where I come in, students are sitting there, I start the lecture and we go and they take notes and bell rings and we're done. Uh, I was doing my undergraduate degree. I. Uh, we had all these things that we had to do, of course, you know, we had to do take all these classes and do all these things. Uh, and one of the things that has changed about uh, my learning style, even though they taught us that the classroom was owned by the students, uh, Turning Point really uh, puts you in a position as a teacher to practice that. 
my classroom management is a little bit different because in traditional schools and a traditional way of teaching, the uh, students, it's about the students, but it's teacher in charge, teacher in control. Meaning, in Turning Point, being a project-based uh, school where we learn by projects, the students are more in control. The students really do own their own learning. Uh, I've developed more of a patience um, in terms to kids working at different speeds, different processing abilities. Um, one thing uh, is the ability to have students fail and, and witnessing people start something and not complete it. Um, I know we've learned a lot in seventh grade class of projects that we've started and, you know, for one reason or another, we, we, we failed. But we use those as learning opportunities as opposed to, oh, F, move on. We, we learn from that. We talk about those more. Um, it's a uh, project-based learning is when you use projects to help you learn. And our school really is involved in project-based learning a lot. And I think it's just a whole lot easier way to learn and a better way to learn. Basically, bigger projects and um, actually getting to do it with people rather than just doing it by myself and maybe. I know this school is for me because um, at the other schools I wasn't able to learn because they would just move on and I would wasn't able to ask questions and here I can. I know it is for me because I want to learn and I don't want to be so shy so I know it's for me probably because I feel like I don't like I feel like I don't get judged by other people or no one else is going to be like oh look she's doing like all that stuff. Yeah. I know Turning Point is for me because I can learn what I need to know. If I'm if I'm in 8th grade math, I can do 8th grade math. It doesn't matter your background, your socioeconomic status, none of that is an issue. It, it's a matter of are you self-motivated. And it doesn't even matter if you did poorly at your previous schools, or you didn't make good grades or whatever. I mean, it's a matter if you're self-motivated and you want to learn, you can be very successful here. You know, I've seen examples of students who probably were terrible at other schools, but they come here, they kind of get bought into it, and they kind of get their feet wet, so to speak, and they realize, man, I, I can learn something here. But the thing is, is it's not going to come solely from me. You know, you can't depend on me to teach you everything here. I'm more of a coach, a facilitator. Uh, you have to want to learn. You know, that's true for any school, but more so here. Because, um, you know, you guys have seen, if you got somebody here who's just apathetic, they're, you know, which is true to any school, but even more so here that, you have to have a desire and a pride in yourself and your peers that you, you want to learn. You also want people that want to work with others um, that are, you know, not necessarily group leaders all the time, but people who do want to collaborate with others and want to learn from others and share their ideas with others. That's kind of the student you want here. It has nothing to do with grades or anything like that. It's personality and, but what I find is somebody who has pride in themselves and, and want to learn for the sake of learning, not because I like history or because I like science, but they want to learn because they enjoy learning. And that's what makes this school good are those students you have here that do enjoy learning, that make it fun. Um, one of the things that uh, I realized when I first came to Turning Point is that people had different perceptions of Turning Point. Some people said Turning Point was the place where all the children who were mentally challenged came, and so I had a hard job. Then some people thought it was the school for all the students that were gifted or enrichment students, and so then, hey, what's really going on? Student Turning Point is a school, a public school. It's open to all students, but we want a student that's the best fit. A student, the students that come here have to be self-directed. They have to be able to work with little directions. Uh, when I say that, it's not that we don't teach people. So, well, oh, that makes your job easy because you're not really teaching. Yes, I am. I am teaching children. Remember that I'm teaching children how to own their own learning.